All right, guys, so up next, we're gonna be going over our arm bar from the mount position, all right? This is one of our most powerful submissions, and as we know, a submission is the main goal of jiu-jitsu. If I can trap my partner in the arm lock and I do everything properly, I'm gonna force them to tap, which is them giving up the match, letting me know that I have won. All right, so for this position, we're actually gonna be starting in the mount. So I've already got my partner down. I've worked my way past his legs. Most times, my partner is gonna be keeping their elbows in tight and their hands up in a safe position, right? For me to do the arm bar, what I wanna focus on is getting the arm across my partner's chest, sliding my legs up nice and high so I have control on my partner's upper body. Now, to get my leg over the head, I don't wanna let my butt hit the floor, so I lean onto my partner first, stepping over. Now, I can focus on separating my partner's hands, lying back to get the finish. If I'm all the way down and I haven't gotten the tap yet, I rotate my partner's pinky, driving it over my thigh to the side here. When my partner taps, I know to let go right away. All right, so let's break this down in a little bit more detail, right? When I'm on top of my partner, I need to get the elbow away from my partner and ideally across their chest where I can start putting some weight on it. I need to block the arm here so I slide my knee all the way up and I change the direction I'm facing. So I slide and turn. I bring my other foot in tight to my partner so I'm all the way on the top half. Here, I'm nice and far from Coach Theo's hips, so even if he were to bridge, I would be less affected by it, all right? If I do a good job, Coach Theo's hands might not be together, but if they are together, once I step over the head, I lean on him stepping over, I need to focus on separating his hands, right? Popping the hands open before I lie back. I can do that with just my arms. I can use a foot to help separate. Once the arm has separated, I start lying back, driving the pinky over my thigh to get the finish. Guys, when I go for the finish, we already know I want to apply it nice and slow, a five second finish. So five, four, three, two, one, if it takes more, that's totally fine, but I'm giving my partner lots of opportunity to escape, as well as making it slow enough where they can tap safely. All right, guys, so one more time. I'm in the mount. I'm getting my partner's arm across their body, sliding my legs up to trap the arm, lean and step. Again, if they're not together, I can lie back right away. If I need to separate the hands, find the best way, lie back over the hip for a five second finish. All right guys, so that is our arm bar from the mount, one of the, good, one of the best submissions we can use in Jiu Jitsu.